wasteland, buddy. Oh, sorry. I landed right on top of someone. <laughs> I sat right on her face. Anyway, we're in the laboratory of the Citadel. And this is where Liberty Prime is usually prepped for battle. Um, we, if you remember, we just finished the main battle a little while ago, so the main quest is over. We're now in Broken Steel. Und here is the first quest, which is Death from Above. We have to meet Paladin Tristan way over at the Rockland Car Tunnel, which is over here. And currently we are right here. So we're probably fast travel to Warrington Station in a little while. But before we do, I thought I'd just uh, look around and see what there is to loot here. Hey, look at that. Plasma rifle. Uh, I'm sure we can do something with this, right? Well, it's almost perfect condition, but let's go in and see the, uh, uh, yeah. Welcome. Hey, what's up? This is the armory. Durga, sell me what stuff. What do you need? Well, I need to repair stuff. I hope you're willing to pay for the parts. Yeah. You're not getting them from our supplies. Okay, okay, okay. A pulse rifle. Uh, oh, that's almost shot. And then my tribal armor needs help. Yeah, we need all that, so let's do it. Good. And then let's see yeah. what she's got to trade. Uh, she could have anything. I haven't looked through her uh, before. <laughs> I'm gonna pat her down and shake her dry of all that good stuff that I... Hey, there's a huge... Well, it's not worth buying that. But there's some things that I should be uh, replenishing, like um, uh, some of my ammo, actually. Uh, I can give her some stuff that I never use, like uh, Stealth Boys, uh, Med Erks. Uh, I do use it, I just don't need that many. Uh, and then here's miscellaneous stuff, and then, um, yeah, there. Uh, not gonna make the dark gun right now. Uh, energy cells, miss, yeah, shotgun shells. I'm just trying to, uh, offload some stuff. Microfusion cells, I don't need quite that many. There, we can make some money that way. There we go. Um, hmm, anything? Anything, anything? Eh, I could use a frag grenade. Okay, pulse, wait, was that plasma grenade or pulse grenade? Eh, don't need it. Um, what else? Anything? Come on. Nope, I think that's it. Okay, thank you. Don't forget to sign out. Okay. Now, by the way, there is um, uh, some side quest that involves the outcasts. Now, we already dealt with the outcasts once, which is Operation Anchorage. Hail. Uh, but then he's going to tell us a little bit service. more about the outcasts. What do you need? Hey, baby. Hey, uh, yeah, hey, what do you scribes do? Why, a great many things. Mm -hmm. There are three orders within the scribes, you uh -huh. see, each dedicated to a different field of study. Okay, that's interesting. I actually went the wrong way. That's all I needed. Bye. <laughs> hey, uh, can you tell me more about the Brotherhood of Steel? Oh, yes, I can. In fact, I suspect I could write several texts on the various details of the Brotherhood. <laughs> but I suspect you're in a hurry. So what particulars would you like to know? Oh, uh, we want to learn about the outcasts. Uh, what's the biggest challenge the Brotherhood has ever faced? It seems like whichever challenge we're facing is always the biggest one. Uh -huh. Survival at first, then expansion, and now cohesion. Cohesion. We've seen plenty of wasteland freaks or would-be dictators. <laughs> They're not too bad. At least we've faced that sort of thing before. But more recent events, like the schism with the outcasts, oh, the those schism. are the problems that worry me. Let's find out about the schism. And, uh... Well, tell me more about it. It's a rather sad story, oh. I'm afraid. Last year, some of our soldiers had grave disagreements with the decisions of Elder Lions. Uh-huh. Disagreements spiraled out of control, and there was a schism in the ranks. Schism, the loyal schism. soldiers practically threw out the dissenters. Mm -hmm. Now they call themselves the outcasts. So that just happened recently, just last year. Interesting. What kind of disagreements did they have? Where Elder Lyons has fought to protect the people of the <clears throat> Capital Wasteland, the uh -huh. outcasts demanded we move on and leave them to their fates. Oh, I see. They insisted there was more important technology to be recovered in a scientific base in the ruins of Fort Independence to the west. As callous as their decision may be, yeah, yeah, it's yeah. more in line with our original mission. Elder Lyons is an inspiration to us, but to them, he's a traitor. Wonderful. 
Boy, he talks a lot, doesn't he? So anyway, that's um, <clears throat> he's talking about the uh, of Fort Independence, which is where they hold up. So they moved out, they got kicked out, so they moved to Fort Independence. And we will visit that uh, sometime. It is a rather discouraging subject, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, it is. We'll visit them sometime. Farewell. In fact, we might kill all of them just to loot that entire fort. <laughs> oh, hey, take a look at this. Uh, Elder Lion's personal log. We haven't listened to any of his yet, right? Here. I cannot, I will not allow the Enclave to control the one thing that could bring even the slightest spark of hope to uh -huh. these people. Which is Project Purity. Project Purity. Would mean millions of gallons of pure, clean water for the people of the oh. capital wasteland. Uh -huh. James never got the damn thing to run. Neither uh -huh. did he, for that matter. But the Enclave, Ooh. if they controlled that much clean water, uh -huh. they would control the entire capital wasteland. They sure would. I simply cannot allow that to happen. Yeah, so uh, the whole, it's all about Aqua Pura now. Well, anyway, we're now going to go back to Megaton before we go to Warrington Station because I haven't reloaded and saddled up since that last battle with Liberty Prime. So we're popping over to Megaton and here we are in Megaton. Um, I think, uh, whoops. I was gonna say I think we're actually okay with uh, with not using bullet time, but um, uh, I've noticed that there's certain times where my frame rate just drops too low. So like I had to use it in the Citadel just a little while ago, and I don't need to use it in here, my Megaton house. Hey, what's up? Good morning, sir. What can I do for you? Joke. Ah. Do you know the best contraceptive for old people is nudity? <laughs> Fine. Well, I wouldn't know anything about that because I'm only 19 years old. All right. Let's see if we... I don't think we have any new bobbleheads. No. God, we got so many bobbleheads still. Um, let me just pick a few things out of this. Yeah. Hellhole. Uh, I can always use grenades. Yeah. And what else? Wild Bill sidearm. I'm gonna have to sell that, actually. That's what I meant to do. It's worth a lot, so let's sell it. And steal canuckles. Yeah, we should just uh, sell all this stuff. Chinese pistol. I don't even know what I'm carrying all that stuff for. Um, you know what? To be able to do this, we need to get rid of 12 of the frag grenades. Yeah, there you go. Because we were over encumbered. Okay, and then over to uh, Moyer Brown, and then we're off to Warrington Station. I just kind of do this to show you, um, you know, the maintenance tasks that I do, because it's not always just shoot them up, right? It is a role-playing game, so there's a lot of inventory management. Oh, shoot. La! There, now it's 12 o'clock, and I think we can go in. Here it is. Okay, hey, Moira. Come on, do it. Any luck finding out how Rivet... No, not yet. Uh, I'll do it no. later. History is what losers become. Haha. <laughs> you go right back and talk to those people and find out something... Okay, later on. Uh, what do you have for sale? Wait. Come on, Moira, give me something. Throw me a bone or something. Don't you have anything exciting? Nope, there's nothing exciting. Okay, well, okay, fine. So it's just going to be me selling stuff to her. It's that, that, that. Chinese pistol, combat shotgun, and then what else? It was a lead poop, and repellent steel canuckles, and Wild Bill sidearm. So long, Wild Bill. Okay, and I think that's all. Yep, let's get Good out of hunting. here. Good hunting. Okay. See ya. I really want to make nuka grenades and bottle Don't cap mines. Try anything. Oh, shut up. Leave me out of that girl's crazy experiments. <laughs> nope, I don't have what I need. Okay, I well, we'll that. make more of that stuff uh, later on, okay? Now, I'm going to show you where we're going. Warrington Station. And... Warrington.
Warrington Station and right into the middle of a battle. And look at the gun that I had out. It was the pulse gun. It was a totally the wrong one. So anyway, there's a bunch of variety of ghouls we have to destroy just like that. Now, I think that was a roamer. There's also a reaver that's attacking us. Uh, there's a glowing one that's I'm about to get right now. There we go. That wasn't too hard. I think that's the reaver. Okay, the reavers. I don't know. It's just a feral ghoul. But there's one more still. Yeah, there he goes. <laughs> that was me trying to kick bullet time back on. Okay, so there's the reaver. Um, we have... Um, uh, he's got a lot of hit points. He's also very deadly. He also spits goo at us uh, whenever he wants. Uh, that's what makes the feral ghoul, or the reavers, particularly deadly. Um, I've lost... I've had to reload many times due to the reavers. All right, that wasn't so bad. Uh, I am on bullet time, so I'm narrating this after the fact. Um, I'm going to loot these. In fact, you can hear the bullet time um, when I'm in my, you know, when I'm in inventory because it's double speed. So what you just heard there is actually um, the sound effects at double speed. Okay, uh, now we've already looted Warrington Station and we've already been through here before, so we're not going to crawl through here again. Um, we've got a Rockland Tar... <laughs> Rockland Tar Tunnel... Car Tunnel to discover, so let's do it. Now, we haven't discovered those buildings over yonder either. Uh, that, those were to the south. So let's just uh, maybe wait until next time. Well, we will eventually discover everything. Um, in fact, I'm going to show you the strategy guide that comes with maps of the area. And I'll sh uh, uh oh. All right. Raiders didn't have a chance. <laughs> I don't know why they even shot at us. Anyway, yeah, I am going to show you the map before we finish. In fact, uh, I'll show you right now. Alright, so the strategy guide splits the wasteland into nine major zones, and we happen to be in zone 7 right now, which is Warrington Station. Uh, there it is, number 12. We're going to pass through a couple of uh, locations before we get to the Rockland Car Tunnel, and you can see that there's 14 primary locations to discover. Of which, I think we've only covered maybe two or three at the most, maybe not even that many. But anyway, we'll do all that later because we've got a mission to accomplish and we don't want to get too sidetracked. We'll do a grandiose uh, tour of the Capital Wasteland later on. Oh, check this place out. <laughs> I was just going to say, it's a great place for an ambush, huh? And who's ambushing us? Nothing other than a robo-brain. There she goes. Thank you. And right here, there's a bug, and I had to splice the video in. Um, it's Fox's uh, laser ga or Gatling laser bug. Anyway, let's end here, and we'll set ourselves up for the next video. Um, we've got a bit of a way to trek yet. In fact, you're going to see it on the, the map in just a second. I bring it up. Yeah, see? So we've only gone so far. Anyway, if you like this one, you can subscribe to my channel and you'll get all these Fallout 3 videos in your inbox. I also upload Skyrim, uh, Bioshock Infinite. I'll be doing the Burial at Sea DLC pack pretty soon. I'll be starting Thief in February. All kinds of good stuff. If you bookmark my channel, you can come back every day. Or follow me on Twitter and you'll get an alert every time I upload something. Alright, we'll see you next time in the Capital.